Hi, it's Leroy for Viking Sports and I have a new game to share. A game with great visuals is magnetic to any kid. They immediately become curious and want to play. And this do-it-yourself Viking Ninja Warrior course is exactly that. Whenever I'm doing Ninja Warrior for Viking, I always have boxes, steps, hurdles, different obstacles to challenge the kids. But sometimes I want to bring that experience home, which means I need to use objects they're laying around the house to turn them into obstacles. The goal of this game is to string together obstacles that address strength, balance, stamina, and agility. When scouring my house, these are some of the things that I found that I was able to use. Once you acquire your materials, lay out a course. Make sure it has an easy flow and test things out before unveiling your masterpiece to the kids. Once everything's set up, show the kids how the course is supposed to work. For the first round of the Ninja Warrior course, have them get familiar with what they're doing by having them race with the course over and over again. Then, make it a little tougher by adding the element of time. Have them race with the course and try to beat their previous time. When they finally beat their times, make it legendary by adding weight and some consequences. These two new dimensions make the course challenging, but in a good way. If they're holding a rock or something that has weight in their hands, it makes the course challenging, and they can't fly through the course like they did in the past run-throughs. What happens instead is they go slower as they begin focusing on trying to complete the obstacles correctly. As the kids get really familiar with the course you just laid out, they're gonna try to shave seconds off their time, which means they're going to begin to take shortcuts. When they try to take those shortcuts, have them do a couple push-ups right after they complete the obstacle they try to rush through or shortcut, or have them do the push-ups once they're done with their run-through of the course. It's important though, that they finish the course and they finish it up strong. If you wanna really kick up the fun, turn it into a family race. Kids always love it when adults jump in. So take advantage of that. Stagger the starts and make it a continuous run-through of the course. So begin the race like you do any race by saying go, and the race only has to end when the kids pass you. This game does require a little setup, but it's all worth it in the end. And if you don't have fun, it doesn't count.